I spent uh, about 30 years uh, at the United Nations. So I, uh, and, and my last uh, uh, position in a way was uh, head of policy planning in the Department of Political Affairs. So I followed the international negotiations and participated and, uh, and, uh, and I have been in different sec sectors in, uh, at the United Nations and uh, uh, starting with uh, environmental statistics, uh, designing a kind of global system for that, but then uh, finally ending up in the political sector. And um, uh, the international system is not really working particularly in terms of the um, climate change and all the threats associated with it, with it. Because we have had over 20 years of uh, intense, intensive negotiations at the technical level, at the political level, uh, in different forums, and uh, climate change, uh, sustainable development. And we have uh, kind of uh, created new boxes and new committees and change them and make them more transparent, and etc. But the basic uh, indicators uh, which are important in this field, that's the, like the greenhouse emissions, uh, carbon dioxide emissions, they have just increased. And they are so uh, dangerous now that we might be uh, passing a tipping point, or tip many, many of the tipping points, and, and turning the tide might be too late if we don't uh, start acting together. The idea is that if we cross certain border uh, border lines, uh, then we we might uh, go into the path which is uncontrollable. We cannot anymore prevent kind of uh, self-reinforcing loops and links, uh, and we we might end up uh, kind of catastrophic uh, climate change. If we are talking about climate change, and and the scientists have uh, identified some 15. Uh, tipping points and, and the science there is quite uh, uh, new and uh, uncertain. My understanding is that the intergovernmental panel on um, uh, climate change has not really tackled the, the issue, uh, how, how these tipping points might interact with each other and, and, uh, and that we were discussing with my colleagues that we should start some kind of project on modeling these kind of issues and that could be a very important one.